What it do, baby? As you can see, I got glasses now. I can see. Huh? You can see though, right? I'm legally blind. I can see barely. I apologize for the uh, the glare and stuff. I'm cheap. I wasn't gonna pay for the anti-glare lens, whatever, bro. Today I'm gonna be showing y'all how to do some arps and sequences in Citrus, and this is what it sounds like. Alright, so we are in FL Studio 20.8. I am at 123 beats per minute. And I created this little drum pattern already to kind of base the ARP off of with a little pad. This is what it sounds like. nice little groovy melodic techno type of of beat going on so that's what we're gonna create the uh, arp and sequence over i have citrus already loaded up and the default you just go here presets default boom and i have a chord on it that goes along with the pad and it is linked to my mixer and i only have a sidechain on it if you put in you know your chords and you have it on default this is what it sounds like so to create uh, an arp or a sequence you go into operator one boom volume envelope and you click on this little arrow right here and it'll say create sequence so you hit create sequence and you'll get this here it gives you all these options. You can change the attack levels, decays, the sustain. But what I like to do personally, I go here and I go into ping pong mode and I just click randomize. And it'll give me, you know, a sequence, a random sequence. And I like to just hit randomize until I get something that I like or I can go into like certain levels and you can just hit randomize and it'll randomize that level. Or you can humanize and it kind of adjusts it to where it sounds less, you know, robotic and stuff like that. But if you just hit randomize, it randomizes everything. Even the uh, sequence here. I'm going to turn it down one octave. I'm going to turn that up a little bit. We go into the filter. You turn this off. This is um, operator one and you turn on filter one and you turn on the output. That way the sound is coming out through the filter. And you, can, you can add some filter to it. So you can go back to operator one, adjust the wave shape to something different. filter go into cut LFO I like adding a little LFO to create some like variation change the speed around now we can go into the effects turn on the effects here it automatically has chorus, so you can turn it off just by dragging this to zero, or you can add chorus if you'd like. Then there's delay one, delay two, delay three, and reverb. I'm gonna turn on some reverb.
shape. And something else you can do is add a second operator in a different filter. So turn on filter 2 on operator 2. And you can create a sequence here as well, volume, envelope, create sequence, randomize a couple of times. You can also change the wave shape here. sequence you can create variations of these you know and make different patterns of them some FM synthesis. Can add some more effects, more delays. are these little arrows right here and you can change them by clicking and right clicking here and it'll, it'll create the arpeggiation break like previous note same note next note stuff like that this is the loop start and this is the loop end That's it, boys. That's it. That's how you do it.
and you can do this with the presets as well i was using the default you know just straight up default but yeah i just wanted to give you guys the uh, basic idea on you know just how to create arps in citrus it could come in handy and it's very you know you can get creative very experimental so let's have a listen one more time i'll introduce it here That's it boys, that's how you do it. Creating sequences, ARPs with citrus. That's it, that's it man. You can apply that to your melodic techno music, deep house, tech house, hip hop, whatever genre you make, you can do it. You can experiment, do different things, do your thing, whatever you want. I hope you understood at least the concept. Um, the best way to learn these plugins is to really just experiment, mess around, change things do your own thing and that's it appreciate y'all for uh tuning in peace